This is going to be a very short video on how to get your Raspberry Pi to boot up into an operating system so you can browse the web. First thing you want to do is make sure you have a mouse and keyboard hooked up to the USB. Mouse, keyboard, and then one HDMI cable. I've got to go into this old monitor here. If you don't have an HDMI cable, you can use this RCA to go to a TV. Next thing you're going to need is one of these. I'm using a 4 gig sand disk and I'm going to put it into my computer and you'll need two pieces of software to make this happen and one of them can be found here raspberrypi.org slash downloads we're going to install Wheezy as our operating system so you want to download that to your hard drive unzip it okay the next piece of software you're going to want is I'm using Win32 Disk Imager pretty simple software unzip it click on it you'll get this dialog make sure it's on the right device, F drive that's correct then uh, select that button and go find that Wheezy that you downloaded and un unzipped double click it there and then simply write it to the, to the flash drive now this can take a couple minutes so I'm just gonna cut it here alright it's finished writing to the flash so we can just exit that program and we can just take this out of here we're done with it and we're gonna go put it into the pie so I'm gonna have to put the camera down here get the disc and here so grab the disc we're gonna slide it into the back of the pie easy as pie micro USB cable we're gonna give this sucker some power see the red light go on it's going to start to flash. Okay, she's booting. And this can, this is the first time, so it could take a bit. Okay, once it's booted, you're going to see this screen come up, and you're only going to see this the first time. So we got to do a couple of things here. First, we're going to go to expand root partition to fill SD card. Press enter. Then we're going to overscan, change to overscan. Enable it. Then we are going to do boot straight to desktop. Okay. And all the way down to finish and then enter. Would you like to reboot? Yes. So that was kind of like a, I guess it's kind of like a BIOS setting. And we're going to let it reboot again. This time it's going to go a little different when it boots. And I did hook up the internet cable here. So we'll see if we get internet right away. Oh, here we go. So we're booting into the desktop here. Most does work. So it boots pretty quickly. Uh, internet. Let's see if we can get some internet here. Google.com. Look at that. Beautiful. Right out of the box. And you want to power it down. Water brain hand corner. And you can just press shut down. There you have it, folks. Start to finish. Only a couple minutes.